We are going to learn and have fun. Let's ask Jesus in the name of Jesus. Samson and Delilah. This is Samson, hey. who was the last judge of Israel. Samson was very strong, and he was supposed to bring God's people victory over their enemies, who were the Philistines. Now Samson fell in love with a woman named Delilah. Oh, hey there. And the Philistines came to Delilah What's going on? and convinced her to find out what the secret to Samson's strength was. Hmm. They promised her a great amount of money if she could do this. Now you're coming. Hey. Come in. So Delilah said to Samson, Please tell me what makes you so strong and what would it take to tie you up securely? Well... Samson replied, If I were tied up with seven new bowstrings that have not yet been dropped, I would become as weak as anyone else. You ain't here! So the Philistine rulers brought Delilah seven new bowstrings. <laughs> Look what I got! Go on, try. And she tied Samson up with them. Ha <laughs> see? Hello, Samson! She cried out, Samson, the Philistines have come to capture you. But Samson snapped the bowstrings. Let me at him! So the secret of his strength was not discovered. Hey, wait a minute. Afterward, Delilah said to him, You've been making fun of me and telling me lies. Now please tell me how you can be tied up securely. Uh, all right. Samson replied, If I were tied up with brand new ropes that had never been used, I would become as weak as anyone else. <laughs> Let me try. So Delilah took new ropes and tied him up with them. See? Oh, no! And again, Delilah cried out, Samson, the Philistines have come to capture you. What? Where? Let me at him. But again, Samson snapped the ropes from his arms. Oh, come on. <laughs> yeah. Then Delilah said, You've been making fun of me and telling me lies. Now tell me, how can you be tied up securely? All right, I'll tell you. Samson replied, 
If you were to weave the seven braids of my hair into the fabric on your loom and tighten it with a loom shuttle, I would become as weak as anyone else. <laughs> now we got him. So while he slept, Delilah wove the seven braids of his hair into the fabric. <laughs> Again, she cried out, Samson, the Philistines have come to capture you. Ah, let me at him. But Samson woke up and yanked his hair away from the loom and the fabric. You gotta be kidding me. Then Delilah pouted, How can you tell me I love you when you don't share your secrets with me? Hey, come on. No. You've made fun of me three times now, and you still haven't told me what makes you so strong. She tormented him with her nagging day after day until he was sick to death of it. All right, all right. Finally, Samson shared his secret with her. My hair has never been cut, for I was dedicated to God as a Nazarite from birth. If my head were shaved, my strength would leave me, and I would become as weak as anyone else. Oh, well, that's it. <laughs> Thank you. Delilah realized he had finally told her the truth, you. So she sent for the Philistine rulers. Come back one more time, she said, for he has finally told me his secret. So the Philistine rulers returned. Oh, Samson. Delilah lulled Samson to sleep. Psst. And then she called in a man to shave off the seven locks of his hair. Samson's strength left him. Then she cried out, Samson, the Philistines have come to capture you. <laughs> when he woke up, he thought, I will do as before and shake myself free. Oh, wh wh what's going on? But he didn't realize the Lord had left him. So the Philistines captured him and took him to prison. We cannot use the real germs because the germs is so small. We cannot see it. Ya, karena germnya terlalu kecil. Jadi hari ini pura-puranya ladanya ini adalah germsnya. And then you will need 
this one plate yeah you can use anything you can use any kind of plate and then you will need this one also this is liquid soap are you ready okay let's do the experiment first you have to pour the water into the plate be careful yeah then let's put the germs inside the plate uh oh so many germs Woo. can you see the germs yeah there are so many yeah so much okay look at my hand my finger it's clean right now what happened if i put my finger inside this plate with full of germs uh oh can you see lot of germs in my fingers now what happened if miss rinta put the other finger inside this soap first and then to this plate wow can you see the germs are go away and look my head my finger is thin there's no germ can you see it yeah which one do you prefer the dirty one or the clean one of course the clean one yeah nah that's why you have to wash your hands regularly with the soap make the germs go away okay nah, that is how the soap works in our hands so the germs the bacteria will go away from our hands and also from our body if we take a bath yeah okay after this we're going to have a little crab we're going to cut 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 are you ready let's do it together okay everybody it's time for crafty time today we are going to make a puppet so puppet now how to make it first you have to prepare what you need first okay please take your straws and also the paper that Miss Rita already give you and then please prepare crayon to color and then please prepare tape letter and also don't forget the scissor okay Let's see what is in the paper that Miss Rinda give. Wow, there is a hand. That is your hand. And then we will have soap over here. Hand soap, liquid hand soap, and also this kind of soap. And then we also have some germs. Oh, let's see how many germs we have. One two three four five okay let's do it the first step you have to color it first let's color okay miss rinta is done with coloring now it's our time to cut 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 use the finger use the scissor Okay, we are done cutting. We have one hand and then two kinds of soaps and also the germs. Now it's time to make the puppet. Prepare your straw and then take the soap. Please ask for from your parent help to stick it. So later on you will have so puppet just like this and also with the other one yeah. 
We are done with the hand soap and also the bar soap bar. Now it's time to play! Put the germs in your hand, yeah? Whoa! So many germs! Which one do you choose? This time I will choose the hand soap. Go away, germs! Shoo, 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 shoo. Yay! It's clean now! Now, later on, you can play again. You can use the other soap also to clean your hands, okay? Keep your hands clean, everybody! Yay! So, those are our activities for today. Hopefully, later you can enjoy the activities. And now, I think it's time for Miss Rita to go. But before that, let's read the Bible first together, yeah? The Bible verse for this month is taken from Psalm 18, verse 32. How is it? It is God who arms me with strength. Yeah, good job everybody. Before we uh, close this video, let us pray first, yeah? Show me your little fingers. I have two hands, the right and the left. Hold them up high, so clean and bright. Grab them softly, one, two, three. Clean little hands are good to pray. Thank you, Jesus, for today. We are going to continue our activity. Yes, us, Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Yay!